This is the other hidden banger from the uh, Peggle Dual Shot OST. There's like exactly one rip of that soundtrack online, and it's got two original songs in it that aren't just shit versions of normal Peggle songs. So I think, I mean, I've already uploaded the other one, but I guess I'm going to have to do the other one too. Because I always like to give a link to these songs, as you guys know. We're doing Donkey Kong Country today. <clears throat> oh, sorry, did I say Donkey Kong Country? No, I meant we're doing Donkey Kong Land today. Which is a weird spin-off. It's the beginning of a weird spin-off series to Donkey Kong Country. That's basically just remakes for the Game Boy. And I'm not talking about the Game Boy Advance. I'm talking about the Game Ass Boy. Just like standard, that like Gen 1 Pokemon was on. So it's kind of a technological marvel that they managed to port these games over to such an inferior system, uh, just in terms of the tech. But I don't know if it's actually fun, I've never played it. Uh, and I have a totally legal copy of it procured. And we're gonna play it today. Uh, we got some awesome art here from Maybe Syrup, by the way. This is just beautiful. This kind of makes me think of... It, it, don't they say that you test the ripeness of cranberries by bouncing them? So this is like the assembly line for grapefruits. They must be bounced first. Each once. You may bounce it once. Uh, but that's very smooth. Cool animation. Thank you. Uh... No, but for real, shoutouts to BizHawk, the best emulator on the fucking planet. <laughs> like, can we just be real here for a second? I didn't realize that it covers, like, 50 different systems. It's insane. It does, it does like, GBA, Game Boy, and, and then at one point I was like, oh, I need to do a Sega Saturn game, and I can't figure out Sega Saturn emulation. BizHawk does it. What? What do you mean? Okay, uh, we are going to unpause. There we go. I haven't tested the volume on this. Uh, this is a masterpiece title screen. I took a little peek at this, just to check if it would, like, work. And man, oh man. Just wow, I... I'm actually speechless. Are they looking at gay people? <laughs> we are going to beat you to death. <laughs> yeah, it does have that vibe. Chat came up with like 10 different jokes that I should have come up with. Like, these are all classic grapefruit bits and I missed all of them. Can you guys just take over, please? Okay, so I've heard, this is what I know about this series, is that there's Donkey Kong Land 1, 2, and 3, and each corresponds to a Donkey Kong Country game. 2 and 3 are relatively unchanged, they're just basically a demake of the game. <clears throat> but this one's like weird, it's different. It has, like, different stuff in it, so... I don't know. I don't know really what to expect. I saw one screenshot of tiny baby man K. Rule, who was, like, the size of Diddy Kong in, like, a toy factory, and I was like, okay, that's different. So it feels good so far. Um, Diddy! Uh... Where did Diddy go? <laughs> was that... I think maybe, uh... When you get the barrel, it like, it like, they couldn't get the two... God, why is the song good? Why is the song still a bop? This is the fucking Game Boy sound chip. It actually doesn't sound half bad. I think maybe they can't load, like, the two sprites at the same time on screen, so you need to, uh... Hold on, I need to do my roll-off trick here. That I invented. Why can't I... I'm the only guy who does this. Wow, uh, can you even do it in this game? You must be able to. There you go. I just suck ass. It was a little heart. You cannot ruin David Wise music. Oh, shit. Wow, I got debated hardcore. Okay, so what happens now? Diddy Kong comes out of the schmism. Okay. I'm gonna try to do this again. Come on, why am I, like, losing my momentum there? <laughs> why is this happening? I'm, like, getting slower for no reason. What the fuck? Okay, hold on. Let's just try jumping. Just damn-ass jumping. Okay, fuck this. Uh, then let's go... Uh, huge waste of time if they don't go... Uh, oh, fuck. Oh, wow. I'm great at this. Is the sound at a good level for you guys? The Game Boy sound chip is goated. 
objectively false. But, I mean, you know, clearly they can make decent stuff with it. Okay, I need to, like, get my head in the game here. This is fucking, like, jungle japes and I'm dying. I'm getting jungle japed hardcore. There's, like, a little less visibility. Oh, I should have fucking bounced off that guy. That guy, that's what you're supposed to do. Great. It's kind of hard to see what's coming. <laughs> yeah. D.K. But it's all, like, squashed. Ooh, nice. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. Oh! Should I have grabbed that? Oh! It's like the, like, Super Mario Bros. vine. Okay. Okay, well, there's a difference right there. Okay, we got Kong letters. It seems like basically the same level. Here's Rambi. Hot damn. You can tell. Look at when I jump. The Game Boy is just struggling to render this. Is that like the midway point? Okay. The, the Game Boy is like two things interacting at once! What do you mean? Oh. Wow, that secret door is like... Anyone else think that's like massive compared to how it is in this NES game? Oh, and this is a swimming level. Oh. Great. Oh, uh, there was no like... I thought there were gonna be more balloons. Oh. Kong, baby. Okay. Oh! <laughs> it's just the void. Wow, okay. You don't grab a flag or anything, you go into the void. <laughs> just like echo. I really wish I could re add reverb to my own voice in real time. I can't even add reverb to things in fucking Adobe Premiere. It's shockingly difficult to do. You would think it would be really easy. I, I can't wrap my head around it. They used to have a thing that was way easier, and then they removed it. Oh! Oh, it's a free guy! Snow level, in the second level. I have no idea how long this game's going to be. I can only assume it's probably a little... Are those flying pigs? That's a completely new enemy, okay. Uh, I can only assume it's shorter than the original. Or at the very least, the same length. Where, uh, flying pigs. Ooh, squeak right- OW! I wasn't- I was looking at chat- fuck. Good. Use audacity- yeah, I- A lot of my issues with editing could be solved by just not being a lazy son of a bitch. And just... Opening fucking audacity. <laughs> you're right, you're right, you're, you're totally right. I refuse to accept responsibility for this, though. Huh. Because I don't want to open a different program, I just want Adobe Premiere to do it! Oh. A few leaps of faith are working out here. Uh, can I just say the controls? I'm shocked at how well it plays. Like, I think you move a little bit slower, kind of like, uh, Super Mario Land. Well, Super Mario Land, you're tiny on the screen, so you don't actually move that much slower compared to other Mario games, but Super Mario Land 2! That one, it feels like Mario is just crawling. I didn't realize there was a tire there. Forgive me, the graphics are, as you can see, slightly muddled. Go up the hill, Donkey Kong. Fuck you! <laughs> okay, I got the midway point, though. He, like, gets pooped out of the little midway portal. I jumped, though. Bitch. What? I jumped. I jumped. I hit- I hit the jump button! Every once in a while I kinda get like stuck on the lip of a platform, that's the one issue I'm having. Let's try to bounce these assholes. Nice. Uh... I jumped! I jumped! I jumped! I jumped! I jumped! Uh, a! I hit A! I hit A and that's the jump button. I, uh, what else do you want me to do, game? DKC kinda has like... Platforms that look a little longer than they are, so maybe I just need to hit the jump button. I feel like it's ridiculous, though. Usually, the, I, I think DKC has, like, coyote frames, right? K-N. Can we get a cog this stream? That's the real question. My classic move. Everybody's classic move. Can I make this jump from here? Yes. Okay, don't fuck this up. 
It's a little harder to like see what's coming. Is all. K N G. You dropped this, King. All right, and oh. <laughs> That is going to make me laugh every single level, I can already tell. Okay, so second level was a snow level. What is the third level? Jungle, again. What's with the little hearts? Are those my lives? Never really... I've just now started thinking about the hearts on the bottom of the screen. I was looking for some sort of indicator if I had a Diddy or not. Oh, look at this. Look at me. Hey, Lamau. Come on. Oh, big coin! <laughs> Good. There's that serotonin. <laughs> this is vines. This is vines. Oh, God. Okay, that's a little crusty. <laughs> it's pretty faithful, though. I mean, listen to the fucking music. How do they do that? I, I, I really hate the... Game. I really hate the Game Boy sound card. I just think it sounds bad. And lest we forget, there are Game Boy Advance remakes of these games. I, I grew up playing the one for DKC3, to the point where I have never played the SNES version. Which, by the way, that would probably be... Uh, if I were to play any other DK game, I mean, DKC-type, you know, game in this series, it wouldn't be the other Donkey Kong Land games, I don't think I want to do that. But, uh, SNES version of DKC3 could happen someday. Uh, all right, where are we, where are we dropping? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Uh, th there's something horribly wrong with the vines. Bounce on that, get the weird thing. Something surreal about the rope just going like... How'd I know those were going to disappear? Classic, classic platformer bit. But now I don't think I can get up there. <gasps> nice. Ooh. Those balloons are motivating me to go fast. And I think it's kind of working out. Hold on. I'm over here, snake. Oh man, I, I think there was like a wall there. No? That was weird. I like couldn't move left there. I was trying to bounce up onto the trees. Oh! The, the void. Uh, the... <laughs> The bounce hitbox feels kind of forgiving. Anyone else see that? <laughs> that was a bit, a bit wacky. <laughs> it's kind of fun. It's a fun game. I'm shocked how fun it is, actually. Oh! Sucks. <clears throat> it's kind of... I love how they just go... <laughs> just go shooting up into the air. Okay. Oh, fuck. These ones keep japing me. They, they, like, don't have as much of a swing. Whoa. Oh. Anyone else hear that? The music was, like, off... out of tune for a second. This Nintendo Switch Online? Fuck. Oh. I'm really sad that, like, all the voice line type sounds aren't in this game. Like Diddy, Ki Diddy Kong saying, Mwah! Fuck. This level's whooping my ass. I was thinking about streaming more Vampire Survivor today. I think I need to take that game in small doses. Because it- in playing it for a long time, it kind of gets boring, honestly. Okay, so these next vines will jape me, if I'm not careful. There you go. Jungle Japes. Question mark. Okay. Uh, hold on. Did I- I think I bounced on a guy I should not have bounced on. Yeah. That was like the way to get up there. Okay, whatever. Oh. <laughs> it is fun. I, I, this is why I wanted to play this one, because it's like, it's got unique stuff. I mean, so far it's not- nothing too crazy, but... Oh, we're at a crossroads. I cannot go either of those ways. Cool. The music is warbling every once in a while. Oh! 
Isn't this a song from 2? In fact, this is like a... I mean, the pirate ship levels are just from 2. The bananas are massive in this game. Like, the, the sprite size is all wrong. Look at how big the bananas are. They're like the size of Donkey Kong. A bunch of bananas. And I saw the screenshot of, like, Tiny Baby Man K. Rule. Spoilers. Fuck. Fuck. Go do the thing where you go middle. I can't go middle. Go up. Oh, okay. That's a DKC2 thing. Uh, go up! Jump! I'm trying to jump. Jump right now. What the fuck? I'm holding up and jumping. Okay, I just guess I just can't do that. Here we go. Ahoo! Oh, I didn't actually get that. Nice. Where, where, where are we going? Am I going up? These are DKC2 enemies, am I crazy? Uh, okay, we're gonna go in here. I'm also shocked that, like, when sound effects play, the music doesn't get fucking butchered, because it's, like, using the same sound channel or whatever. Okay, some platforms... Oh, I see, it's when it has those little ring things. You can, uh, you cannot jump through it. Oh, nice. Oh! <laughs> That was very abrupt. Oh, I'm in, like, the city! It's like a ruined, raptured city? This is gonna be huge for the DK lore, I can already tell. I wonder if this game is considered canon by, by Miyamoto-sensei. I was not expecting them to mix elements from the different games. <clears throat> Maybe they were under the impression... Because the, the snow level was kind of DKC3-esque, I guess, although the other games have snow levels. It's kind of hard to tell. Uh, Maybe it feels like they only thought they were going to make one of these games, and then they got authorized to make more. Complete speculation, fuck. Okay, well. Oh. I imagine this would look, like, a little bit better on actual hardware, weirdly enough. Some retro games do be like that. Okay, this- you can tell this one's for, like, a puzzle, because it respawns. No? No, I'm done. It just, like, something about the way I, like, threw it off there didn't- like, it just reset. Like, it's just not meant to be displayed on our, like, modern screens. Oh, it's, uh... Fuck, Espresso? <gasps> the Pac-Land controls. This is just like Pac-Land. Oh. Uh. What do you mean? Huh? It had a little bomb above it. I don't know. I don't rightly know, and I, uh, maybe I don't care? I Maybe something late, like earlier in the level changed? Fuck it. Ah! <laughs> Kong, we've been getting a lot of those. And this one, I just now, like, consciously thought about this. This one has a save system that just saves after every goddamn level. Like, it always should have. That was one of the biggest flaws of the uh, original series. Oh, I got a bomb from the barrel. Oh. I see. It's a little bit of Mario 3 overworld action, like the hammers. It's kind of cute. <laughs> okay, this looks like the first level of DKC1. Oh no, never mind. Never mind, there's instantly a flying pig. Is there something secret up here? Uh, maybe up here? Cock? Oh, it's those fuckers. Annoying enemy. Uh, you know what? Screw it, I don't care about those secrets. Oh! What's down there? Is that a barrel I can go into? Fuck. Uh... I- I swear I saw something down- I'm gonna do it. It's a- <laughs> It's a tire. I thought- I don't know! You can't see! 
Maybe there's a way to uh, look down. Probably not. It was a tie. It's like, man, if only Diddy Kong wasn't ridiculously nearsighted. Wow, that was... Wow. Fun minigame. Fun bonus. I really thought he was just gonna, like... He spawned right above the hole, and he's the perfect size. Just... Aah. Shoom! He just fits right in there. Nice. That's what those enemies deserve. Oh. Uh, oh, I should have saved it for that, though. Fuck. They baited me. My hatred. I'm not gonna get in that barrel, because I think it would just kill me. I could be wrong. Fuck. I got the midway. It's weird. I, it really feels like these... Wow, look at that sprite interaction. <laughs> uh... Maybe they just couldn't get, like, the flag to work for whatever reason? I don't know. I should have saved it again. Fuck. I'm a dummy. Huh. We're gonna go the run strategy. Good, it worked. But, like, the sprite itself, like, the sprites of, like, Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. COG! Oh, I just got a message. Uh... uh. Oh, nice. Like, look at the sprite of Donkey Kong. It's like... <laughs> if you really look at that shit up close, you're like, Whoa. What am I looking at here? But, I, I mean... Let's be honest with ourselves. Did it ever look really great on SNES? I mean, that's it's a good-looking SNES game, but, like... The game has aged. Clearly. Oh, by the way, Lark's streaming right now. Uh... He's doing, like, listening to music and, uh, some weird, like, art project he's working on, so go check that out if you want to. Cug. Bring, bang. Okay. I, I love that, like, it seems that no other new enemies have been added. Just flying pigs. I'm sure there'll be more later. What is, uh, what is up with that? Try to like get to it. Uh, I don't know if that's possible. The respawn animation is so weird too. Like, there's just a few things that it feels like the tech just wasn't there. But it's got like the HUD that hides when you don't uh, use it for a while, shit like that. Because it's just like. No, it just feels like a really arbitrary decision, because what is functionally different about this and just the barrel that you break? And it... and it's just the checkpoint. I don't know. I I'd love to be a, a fly on the wall of the... the studio, and also understand Japanese. <laughs> as long as we're picking superpowers. It's knowing Japanese. <clears throat> what the fuck is this? Is this supposed to just be a bird? I think that's just, like, one background detail. It's just a fucking bird. I can't, like, do anything. I'm holding up, I'm holding down. Pressing A, I don't know. Uh, okay. Huh? Oh god, what? Sometimes when you roll jump, it, like, cancels your momentum for some weird reason. I do not know why. Whoa, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. New enemy. That's kooky. It's like such a smooth animation, actually. Why would I like go right next to it like that? Uh, maybe if I like... Mm -hmm. I feel like you could finagle this one. No, it, oh, you bonk your head even if you're like a mile away. Never mind. It's not how ropes work. I don't know if DKC2 ever pulled this bullshit. Okay, I know this is really- oh, I got it. I, okay, the hearts are confirmed one-ups. Good. Good. I forget entirely what I was even fucking saying. Oh! That invincibility doesn't last too long. Does it? Cool. You just get, like, dumped out of the portal. I don't know, maybe they just felt obliged to make some new stuff? 
hence making like a lot of it different. People. Just look at how the barrel like moves around and it like the parts of Donkey Kong's hands that it touches are corrupted. They're soiled. Donkey Kong goes to heaven. Like I straight up landed on the ground there, but still bounced on that enemy. I don't even know how that works. Fuck. Okay, we're speedrunning this bitch now. Oh, we're going down. What even happens when they drop off? They die. Good. I'm glad. Fuck. Okay, am I gonna suffer the exact same fate? Just fucking go down. Just don't even go up there. Roll into enemies. It's Donkey Kong Country. You can do that. Oh, they're on both. Ooh, what do you mean? Damn, that was kind of nuts. Okay. Managed to do it, though. <laughs> it's definitely not, like, a substitute for DKC in any way. But this sure does exist. It's got unique level design stuff, I, I, I guess. I'm just kind of baffled that this exists. It's pretty ambitious, but they kind of... They, they nailed it? <laughs> as weird as it sounds to say. I love the one bird in the background, just occasionally. It's just like, they tried. Okay, let's wait for another one to pass by. If that's going to happen. Okay. <laughs> I think there might have been a thing up there too. I don't really care that much. I don't think, I don't think my goal is to 100% this game. Oh, good. Uh, I think these... I think it had, like, blocking things at the top. Fuck. I just wanted to see... <laughs> the sound going crazy! Why? I, we never... Ex I, I, this is the same emulator that I used... I mean, Game Boy to, that, that, that I used to play, like, Rhythm Tengoku and shit. We never had the warbling on that. Oh! <laughs> Donkey Kong's falling corpse collected the end. Uh, oh, fuck it. Let's just see what's up here. Nothing. It's weird. Just when there's little discs at the top of the rope, that means you can't jump up through it. Okay. I guess let's go here and go down. I, I don't know if at any given time I'm just descending willingly into a bottomless pit to my death. This game could gaslight me so hard. And, uh... You know, Donkey Kong Country games are not, like, super cruel in their game design. But they do, they do gaslight you sometimes. It does sometimes happen. Or just, there's just, like, dick moves. Like, the one part of that, like, bramble level in... Wait! I had a DK barrel, though. What? I, like, just ran through one and it exploded as though I still had a partner. Huh? Why did I die there? I thought I had another guy. The music is struggling so hard! Is there anything I can do about this? <laughs> Hold on, why is it doing this? Uh... Hmm. One moment. I'm sure it's like if I use a different sound driver. Output method. Let's just try this. That is definitely still... <laughs> that is definitely still fucked up. Although I guess that was trying to go... Right? Maybe that's just a funky sound. Uh, I think we're just gonna have to deal with it. I, I don't know, there's probably a solution, but I'm not... I don't know, I tried like all the different sound drivers. It, it seems to primarily affect the map screen. So... Oh, I can just go here. 
But I haven't even beaten this level. Wait. It's just because it's like a technically a previous level. Okay. I was like, can I just walk past all the levels? Is this like Braid? Where you can just walk to the end of the game? I really meant to jump. I seriously, I tried. I wonder if this happens on actual hardware. I remember saying like, oh, there's like emulator shenanigans with... I just didn't even touch it. What? I was not even close to it. Throwing away my lives here. Holy shit. It's like you need to do this to jump here. Holy fuck. There was like a visual glitch that was happening in Super Mario Land, and I was like, oh, that's obviously emulator jank. And people were like, nope, that just happens on an actual Game Boy. I was like, oh. And I've, I, I first played it on an actual Game Boy. I never noticed. Because it's stuff that's right next to like the lip of the screen that has like a little sort of shadow on an actual Game Boy. So it's hard to notice. But then I, I booted up my own copy of it when people said that, and I was like, wow, it does indeed do that. This B. I thought it like moved sides for a second. No, I'm just tripping balls. Huh. It's just so scary when there's like not even any platforms visible. It, there is only void and monkey. Okay, so does that or does that not get me a DK? Like it's not the type on the ground that you can grab. I was holding B. B. B! You fucking nuts. Can't, I can't not think of, like, the Patrick Warburton. Oh! It, like, why do you... The secrets are so weird. Normally you just, like... I mean, I guess it's... That's in, like, 2 and 3, where you, like, go into holes in the ground. But here it's like a hole in the ground shows up, and then you... A rope comes out of it. The holes in the ground were in DKC1, but I don't think you ever went to a secret level, like, through it. Fuck. I tried to jump. I, there's something fucked up about the fucking jumps, guys. It's consistently happening. There's something fucked up. I've been, like, talking up this emulator. It's fucked. I'm jumping, and it's just not happening. Which I feel like is an issue that... It's pervasive on emulator. I don't think this is going to be a main channel video, no. <laughs> there was a gap there. I'm going to, like, game over here. But with the new save system, how does that even work? Is it like a modern Mario game where it just, like... It's like, game over, teehee! Uh, okay, well, you you don't actually get penalized. <laughs> oh, you, oh, no, you lost the mid-level checkpoint. Frickin' boo-hoo. Okay, let's not do that. In that moment, I did not try to jump. I just, I just plunged. I just s fell straight off the fucking thing. Okay, try to pick it up. Nope. It's clearly floating. I swear there was one time I just straight up didn't have a second life. Ah, uh, singular bird background detail. You're my only friend. I really liked when they tried to imitate the monkey sounds. But it just sounded fucking awful. Oh, fuck! It's- I had the rope! I don't like the ropes. Are you gonna spawn any more of those fuckers? Just go fast. Also, the ceilings there, the actual hitbox of the ceiling is like a mile beneath the, like, graphic of the ceiling. Did you fucking see that? That keeps happening. <laughs> okay, DK clearly came out of that one. Like, you bonk your head, like, five miles beneath the ceiling. I think that was to try to prevent you from, like, cheesing, because those are the things, like I said, that very deliberately don't let you jump past them. They... they overdid it. I swear that bee, like, moves. And not just in a little circle, but, like, it's... It's home. It's Scuttlebug home moves. Hmm. 
I'm, I might also use, like, save states and shit if it gets too annoying. But we'll see. I tend not to resort to that. Do I even want to do this? I still am none the wiser as to what these coins do. Good. It's like, should I save right before this part? I'm gonna do it. Call me an asshole, I'm gonna do it. Save, state, that's nothing, that doesn't say anything. Why was I able to jump up there? What the fuck do you mean? I hate this. Do you see how I bonked my head? Okay, okay. Go way, way down on the rope. So that you don't get, like, yeeted into that guy. Oh. What the fuck? What? What? Okay, that is jank as fuck. I, like, landed halfway in it, and it, like, propelled me down. I jumped, and it, like, clipped me down. Wow. Cool. Wow, worst thing in the game, these little things at the tops of the ropes that keep fucking me up. Well, boys, it's a good thing I came prepared. Shocked that didn't hit me. Uh, man, I, it really, like... It is insane, the, the, the rate at which those spawn. Like, you really need to just jump up to the level where they are not there. You know what might be happening? I think the hitbox of these fucking obnoxious things is, like, not there because the, the game is not, like, loading them in when I'm, like, going off screen like that. But then when they're on screen, I conk my head into them about a mile below. I think that's what's happening. I think that's really what's happening. Okay. That's the jank that's going on. Figured it out. It is, like... I'm holding right, by the way. Like, I'm holding fucking right. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Can I just bind F1 to a fucking key on my thing? Hold on. Actually, no. Hold on. This part is fucking obnoxious. Like, you, you need to be so perfect to not take damage from it. Like, you have to... Like, look at that! Like, you jump directly up, like, really high, straight away. This is actually fucked. This part is actually fucked. Like, it, do you guys see this shit? Like, okay, go all the way down. Go, fuck. Okay, maybe like... Jesus Christ, okay. Fuck me. Great profile. Spinus. I don't have to name it. And we're gonna just literally bind Y to F1. That is the reload state button. And then... Yeah, I'm probably gonna accidentally reload the state. Fuck it, just accept that it's gonna fucking happen. I don't even know what happened there. I was holding right and I jumped fully. Oh, it respawned me here. I think I need to, like, zigzag back and forth between them. I don't know. Like, tediously? Just, like, go to the point. That's so jank. Go crisscross. We did find a strat, though. Crisscross until you go to the point where they're no longer... Their spawner is, like, on screen. You know? There's, like, an invisible thing that's spawning them there, and when it's on screen, it doesn't, uh... Oh, fuck. When it's on screen, it doesn't actually do anything. So just, like... Hop back and forth up there to, like, get rid of that. Oh. Wacky. Jesus Christ, that was so much more difficult than it needed to be. <laughs> what was the point of that cannon? I guess that was just like a... Actually, that was good. That, it was like a safe way to descend. Also very scared because you get basically no invincibility. Did you guys happen to notice that when I jumped on the tire that makes you jump higher, it did literally nothing? And I landed, like, very squarely on top of it? Did you guys pick up on that part? I had, now I gotta redo the fucking snake. 
Actually, I, maybe I should just see what happens when you game over. Fuck, I did not want to go to the right there. If you tap right on the rope, it, like, locks you into a little long animation of swiveling. I wonder what happens if I just, uh... It's so janky, like, it so feels like you should just be able to jump up there, but there's those weird discs that make it impossible. <laughs> I hate you strange discs. Strange mystery discs. There's even a little arrow there to indicate that takes you down. Okay, we're gonna end it like 90 bananas, right? Boom. Okay. Should I maybe just save here? What is the, uh, save button? Shift F1, okay. So we're gonna bind shift... We're gonna bind shift to Y and F1 <clears throat> to X. So if I want to save, I hold down Y and hit X. Boom. And then if I want to load, I just hit X. I don't know. It sounded like bone trousel for like half a second. I was like, it's bone trousel! And then I was like, no, it's not. Uh, what's here? A cheeky secret? No. That's just a thing. Okay. So there's a bee here that comes from off screen. I know this because it killed me. Fuck. Man, this is a really fucked up pirate ship. <laughs> okay, make sure I get a good bounce on this thing. I just like managed to jump off the actual platform there and not the tire. <laughs> oh, so close. Uh, okay, I just feel the need to like inch along. Anything up there? Oh. <laughs> Fuck, man. Okay, should we do the little bonus level? Oh. It's not how I was expecting that to work. Okay. Uh, let's do the- let's just see what this level is. Ooh. God, this snow music is shockingly good. Oh god. We're gonna start working with the lives back up because I'm gonna be fucking saving constantly. Speaking of which. Huh. I have no qualms about scumming through this game. I don't think I used save states for... the normal DKC series. Maybe once or twice in like DKC 2 or something. Fuck. I don't think I did much. Here... hmm. It's cool, but there's definitely, like, parts of it that are annoying. But, like, the normal gameplay is good. I died. I, I could just abandon- abandon hope all you who enter here. Those fucking- that- that rope shenanigans was annoying, man. I should have just loaded the state, maybe. I keep, like, forgetting where the last one was. I'll just keep going from here and- if I die, I'll load it. <clears throat> That's Nutty Beaver, the the beaver that is canonically in Banjo Kazooie. I think is it Banjo Tooie? I forget. No, it's Click Clock Wood. So that's that's Kazooie. Because I haven't played Tooie. Because I heard it was bad. <laughs> I heard it was bad. Or that it was, like, tedious. I didn't hear it was like... I don't think it's terrible. Is that a barrel down there? That is a barrel down there. Hey, Lamau. Wow. <laughs> okay. We're getting, like, glimpses of later levels. Oh, there's bananas. I thought those were like a little bubble effect. That's cute. You can see stuff through the cracks. I thought that was like bubbles going by. Ba -ba -ba. Oh god. Whoa. <laughs> this is the camera couldn't catch up with me. Oh, hey. A cheeky secret? Only for special boys. 
Oh! A second exit. Okay, let's try this. Alright, fine. Save state moment. Oh, weird. Well, what was the... I don't really know what the significance of the other one was. Is there... What is this level doing? Where it's got an exclamation mark by it. Is that normal? That transition is so jank where you can access this level from both different... You can access it from here or from the other version of this map screen. No, I think those are like... Whether I got like all the coins or something, I don't know. I don't know what the little exclamation mark signifies. I thought maybe like the secret exit like changed something in that level. Okay. I'm sorry that I missed that one banana. I tried. <laughs> Not sorry enough to go back for it. Beaver. All the secrets? Possibly. Oh, fuck. Another bastard enemy. The vultures that, like, spam nuts. Okay. Oh, fuck. Maybe I should have, like, jumped up there. Maybe that would have been, like, a hidden barrel secret. This is fun, though. I mean, it's, it's mostly fun. It is mostly fun. With, with frustrating parts. Is that, it's like, transparent. No, it's just that its sprite lines up eerily well with the background. Look at that, when it has wing folded like that. It really looks kind of semi-transparent there. For a hot second. What do you mean that didn't bounce me up there? What do you mean I can't get up there? Oh, what do you mean? Oh, that's... Annoying. Okay, whatever. I tried to bounce off the enemy to get there. It didn't work. Okay, the sound channel stuff is still happening. It's just not like... Like, some games, it's like... When you fucking jump, they just like... <laughs> certain... Like, the melody of the song gets removed. Oh. That was a secret. Oh. Normally, secrets get activated just by holding a barrel next to them. So I was like, oh, it's not a secret. Okay. It's like a weird new type of secret. I've never seen that in the normal games. Weird! <laughs> it's just so weird. <laughs> oh, this is a dumb idea. Wow. I thought I could go up higher than that because I saw a bee up higher than that. But no, those bees are just there to menace you, taunt you. Why'd I do that? Oh, I for some reason thought there was going to be another rope to jump there. Another rump to jope there? Good! Mmm. <sighs> My last save state was like after I beat the last level. It's not a huge deal with this level. Hey, can we get the bounce here? Look successful. Come on! That was perfect! That was so good. Oh, okay, let's just like slowly descend here. We gotta actually bonk that. That's so jank. I think other secrets in this game have functioned like normal DKC secrets. Or DK secrets. Huh? It's one of those obvious jokes I like feel bad about even making. Like, sh it's like what I call a shut up joke. Fuck! Okay, I'm gonna reload the state. Fuck it. Actually, no, let's just see what happens. Like, does it just. Okay. So, it was functionally identical to. Except now I think I get a bunch of lives. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. That's fine. So it is, it is like the new, the modern, the like pussyfootin' way. The infinitely fucking better way of dealing with the live system. I mean, the better way is just to not use it. Full stop. Is this maybe a... See, now I want to yeet at the secrets. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forget, in DKC, is that one of the things that can give you like a, a one-up? Here's how you get up here. Oh, and I even... I, like, got up here before, and I... Right? I'm a, such a fucking dumbass. 
famously stupid uh, internet comedian, internet funnyman, Grapefruit, known for his stupidity. Okay, so we gotta redo the beginning of the level. So what? Big deal. No, this is- no, this is a different thing. This is a different thing. It's just a nearly identical formation. No, I'm not dumb. I'm very intelligent, actually. Uh... Right. I'm just so- <laughs> you can feel the trepidation... ...in my voice. In my play style. But I, I, I don't- I'm scared of what's next. Okay, here we go. Uh, that hit me! Fuck! There's actually a very small space to occupy there that will not hurt you. Cock. Okay, don't jump off here like a fucking jackass. Don't get- it's not even like jebaited, that's just- why did you do that? Oh shit, did you see what just happened there? Let's- let's get an instant replay on that one, folks. The bananas were not on screen, so they didn't load in. So, since I went too fast for the camera, I just, like, clipped through some of the bananas straight up. Look at that. Oh, now I got him. That was so jank. I love it. Ah! I think, wasn't this, a like, a weirdly lucrative series for Nintendo? Like, this was, like, a pretty... It sold well, right? Anybody play this as a kid? Anyone in chat? I'm sure some people have. Okay, I gotta remember what's save. Good. We're just gonna take that as a quick precaution. Nice. Is there something over there? There is. Ah! What the fuck is that? Oh! Oh! <laughs> That's new! Okay. <laughs> Didn't get much time to uh, really adapt to that. You press the button, coins come out. You're supposed to get the coins. I don't know, a cannon started shooting at me and I, my instinct was not to immediately try to run into the things. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. That was bad. Cool. Oh, and like, it, it goes away after you fuck up once. But I managed to hit it twice, and it just, like, before it left, I could sneak in another one. The, the music is... I'm telling you, the music is good. Okay, so, like, actually wait for it to... Fuck! <laughs> I'm so bad at that. It, it moves so fast! Some of the, like, barrel blast parts in the original series are, uh, famously some of the most brutal segments. So it doesn't seem like there's, like, any drop-off for a really long time here. Fuck. There you go. Oh. <laughs> I, like, tried to get hit by that guy. Nice. Okay, we managed to tag that. <laughs> okay, that can happen sometimes. Always very fortuitous when that happens. Mm. Nice, okay. Okay. Mm. <laughs> oh. require the utmost focus for those parts. Cook. They always, like, stick just, like, one random enemy at the end of the level. That's some of the, like, dickish... Some of the dickish design. There's always one just random enemy at the very end of the level. Just to, like, fuck you over if you're desperate. <whistles> Stressful, but fun. It's... Uh, I mean, the good levels are, like, roughly on the same level of quality. It just looks like this. Bum, ba, bum. Whoa. 
Is this a boss? What the fuck? This is new. Stingray enemy? What am I trying to accomplish here? Okay, thank you. Are we just killing a lot of these? I think we're just killing a lot of these. Okay. Whoa. He's mixing on me. He's schmixing. Nice. Uh. Wow, that was a weird fucking level. That was very bare bones, honestly. Okay, now we got like the temple cave level. That was really weird. That was a very bizarre boss fight. Just a bunch of little goons. I thought it was gonna do the fucking like alternate Dr. Mario song. It is. It does have that sort of like a lot of platformers on the Game Boy because it's so. The aspect ratio is so, like, near... I think it's almost exactly a square, if not just a square. Uh... You move slower in a lot of platformers on this system. Because they wanted, like, the same level of sprite detail as other games of the time, like, roughly, you know. But they also wanted... I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. You get what I'm saying, kind of. Oh, fuck. I just realized what song this is supposed to be. It's the fucking Xavier Renegade Angel song. But it's like a upbeat version of it. It's like they wanted to compensate for the weird shape of the screen by making the characters slower. Which kind of makes just some of the platforming action a little less, like, exciting. Like, Wario Land 1. You know? I was really hoping I could make that jump without having to push the tire, but whatever. This is a weird remix of this song. See, this is interesting to check out. And I, I almost want to look at one of the other ones just to see how much closer they are to the source material. You can straight up land on the ground sometimes and still bounce on an enemy. <laughs> If you love bananas so much, why don't you marry bananas? It's been a while since I've watched Xavier Renegade Angel. Fuck. <sighs> but like, I'm shocked at how good the controls feel. For what it is. There is my classic move of landing on the ground and still getting the bounce. Wow, 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 wow. Nice. We're doing fine. I mean, the save states are not necessary, really, uh, except... I don't know. In that situation where I wanted to... Wow, same exact thing. Uh, in that situation where I just wanted to get past that really annoying part. Oh, fuck, I keep missing it. I keep forgetting that's there. Fuck. I gotta, like, keep my fucking Diddy Kong for this part where the dude jumps really high and I can't... <laughs> Apparently my brain can't figure it out. Okay. Bounce. Kids his age bounce. Fuck! I keep... <laughs> it's just they keep coming out of nowhere. Because all that being said and done about how the characters are slightly slower... I still fucking... Oh, there's a barrel there. I still am caught off guard. Rambi, how were you in that box? That box is tiny compared to you. I feel like these bananas were not placed in such a way to do this. Oh, I need to, like, hold A. Okay. Huh. Fuck these enemies. There you go. D. K. 
Donkey Kong. I I considered saying Dong Chat, but I thought it was too obvious. I thought it was too gauche. Is that passe to say Donkey Dong? Okay, uh, it's weird that they got the, like, Mario 3, like, rocks mechanic. Okay, time for there to be a bunch of, like, hidden shit behind these pillars. New enemy? No, that's the, like, clownfish. Oh. Uh, I'm not familiar with that. Still, still don't know what these coins do. Fuck! You know, I bet... Nice. <laughs> I bet that- fuck! The, uh... The coins get, like, lost when you- when you game over. Yeah, the, no attempt was made for there to be some sort of, like, screen filter for underwater. You know, I was talking to one of my friends earlier today, and I was saying that Donkey Kong swims with, like, a breaststroke. And I'm now looking at his sprite, and I guess that's only in, like, the newer games. Because here he's just got kind of like a doggy paddle thing going on. I swear in the new ones he breaststrokes, though. I was- I was musing to my friend that what if- what if when he got to the surface of the water he just switched to butterfly. It was like, arr, arr. It would just look very funny, I think, on Donkey Kong, specifically. Uh, this is annoying, by the way. It's a water level. Which means I would like to get through it as fast as possible. Huh. Uh. Yeah. Fuck. You need to, like, do the trick where you hold down and swim, and you kind of do, like, a little stilted swim that actually is pretty useful. Nice. Man. Imagine eating a banana that large. Huh! And... On. Okay. Oh god. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> I'm so scared! <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I I really don't know what I'm like looking at with this enemy. Like, what is this? What am I seeing with my eyes? Just a strange little man. Okay, are there things hidden behind these? No, I think. Oh, just a couple bananas that were incidentally there. I think that was maybe just the gimmick of that one bonus level. I hope, because it would be obnoxious if there was just hidden stuff there that I could easily miss. You know. Okay. Fuck. Clams, spiders, urchin, some sort of urchin. <laughs> uh, so we're not gonna get that because I didn't get the K. Did not realize this when I grabbed the O, but I should have. And now I'm gonna grab that W. Ow. <gasps> God damn- what? what? What do you mean? Okay, hold on. It's too hot. I'm just robing. Eh. Okay. Ooh, that was a good neck crack. Okay. Water level. I might need to- I might need to really, uh, focus here. Ha. Ah. Okay, go up. I, like, made it past so many of these on a previous attempt, just, like, on a lurk. It's not really how you use that phrase, I just wanted to say lark. Cook. Nice. Uh, you know what? Safe state. Fuck it. <laughs> I 
I got shit to do. I got shit to do. I gotta get on a fucking plane. I don't actually have to get on a plane. Alright. I just can't wait to see the Tiny K rule. <laughs> I can't wait to see more bosses. That one boss was so bad. <laughs> okay, I was so close that one time, too. Oh, hey. Nice. Don't know what this does, but I'm gonna get it. Fuck it. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> I want to see DK do the little dance where he claps and gives you a thumbs up. Are we about to hear this game's version of aquatic ambience? Look at the crab. Look at the crab. Look at its eyes. What do you think it's seen? Wow, no shit. They could barely get this song on the fucking SNES, and they put it on the Game Boy. It is, of course, not identical, but it's pretty good. <laughs> it's so like slippery. I love the like harp. There's a harp that goes like in the original song. It's so cool. Okay. Oh, there's a huge gap there. A huge grant. Okay, we've got like the the spiky tire enemies. I think we're just from the very <clears throat> last few water levels of DKC, right? It feels like they not only are they adding a few new enemies here and there, but they're kind of like mixing and matching the different games. Like there's some DKC two shit in here. It's very weird. Not exactly what I was expecting. I was just expecting it to be like I don't know. They just made up a bunch of bullshit, but they kind of just like took pieces from all the different. Entries in the series. Also, I'm sorry you just heard sirens. That's like the the one bad thing about the AC <clears throat> unit that's in my room. Is that it doesn't quite muffle sound as well as a thick, solid glass window. So you guys can hear like the sounds outside. I live in the city. And yes, I know I have to survive before any of you say. Okay, I've been told a thousand times. <laughs> yes, I am aware that I have to survive. Jesus fucking Christ. You can stop telling me now. <laughs> now I got that song stuck in my head. That is also... <laughs> I hate to say it, a certified banger. Sonic R is one of those games that is entirely carried by its soundtrack. I just- I know I've said this a thousand times before, but I love the fact that the Sonic series- oh, hello- has two different songs about surviving in a city. <laughs> Specifically. Like, City Escape and that one from Sonic R that I don't even know the name of. Wow, that was a fucking good secret. I have not played Sonic R. I think... Uh, I almost said Sonic and I. Andrew and I might play it at some point. Maybe we'll do Sonic R and Sonic the Fighters. It's like, again, I hate to, like... I know it's a bit of a... a a sore spot for the internet to see Let's Players shitting on bad Sonic games. But I, I've, like, played all the good ones. That's not true. I'll play CD in Mania. I've heard CD is just, like, bad, but I'll play it. <laughs> I've heard it's also... It's a classic, it's just also bad. I'll play Mania. I don't know, I might play Advance or Rush. That's kind of unlikely, I think. And then, like, Sonic RPG? No way. He knows Sonic IRL. 
Yeah, ugly Sonic. No. Nice. Giving DK a haircut. Just like that one episode of the fucking CG animated show. I want that banana so bad. There you go. Where he lost his hair and he lost his power because he's fucking Hercules. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's just a little slippy slidey. Oh. Yeah, yeah, those sprites are doing very well. In good health, those sprites. Really hate those little floaty enemies. I detect we must be close to the end. <gasps> I detect we must be close to the end. I'm like a fucking NPC from Half-Life. Okay, calm down. Fuck. Germa's like possessing me this stream. I'm like doing Germa's bits. I'm sorry. I'll stop. I'll stop. <laughs> Panasonic Blu ray. It's Christmas in July. 32-inch LCD TV. Everything's on sale in July. Am I really gonna bother to get that secret every time? Panasonic Blu-ray. That is a banger remix. I'm shocked that I just like stumbled upon that random ass secret. Wanted to get that trouble banana in one fell swoop. It's just so stressful. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's get the bananas. Waterlogged, soggy bananas. The soggy banana is almost certainly a tavern in Britain. They didn't even have to, like, cut certain parts of the song out or anything, I don't think. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Glad we got Donkey Kong. So I can fucking die. I didn't take a save state. You took a save state. Fuck you. Oh, ho ho! That's quite the maneuver they're making you do there. Cool. Yeah, I'm glad I took a safe state. It's just these really fast tires. <laughs> okay. Oh! <laughs> well, for me. Uh, can I go in the hole? Weird. Because normally you would exit the level- Oh, that's- Guys, that's like- Either the, either I'm not understanding this properly, or that hole right there is like cut content. I bet you- it, A solid 15 bucks that initially they wanted you to leave the level through a hole like you originally do, but then they got this weird like Wario Land 4 thing instead. I'll bet you 15 dollars. That's how confident I am. I need to blow my nose. Okay, so I can only assume that in this level there will be a bomb thing. Maybe a later level. I keep thinking it's gonna do fucking like, what is that, fever from Dr. Mario? <laughs> But no, it's this weird, funky remix. Definitely an interesting play. Whoa! What the fuck? It, like, gets closer to me when I look away from it. What? <laughs> what? Do I need to, like, jump on it and it'll, like, make me spin or something? It'll propel me. It looks like the bananas there were like, hey, do a big, tall jump off it. Okay. 
Okay. Fuck, I bet there's a uh, secret at the end of this segment. Cool! Very cool. Hold on. Classic. When you pause, everything just vanishes. I'm gonna go to my good friend howlongtobeat.com and type in... I should have done this before. I'm just curious. Two and a half hours. I mean, how many... Donkey Kong Land... I'm gonna do walkthrough because it'll show the number of worlds that are in it. Okay, there's... We're in the second world, I think? And there's four worlds. And how long have we been going? An hour and 17? I might cut this game in half. I think I'm gonna cut this game in half and do two streams of it. We'll see. We'll see. It's on... It's definitely, like, on the fence. I don't know. Oh, God, those keep... They, they keep getting me. I keep just forgetting they're there. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. That is weird. That looks very out of place. Fuck. The death sound was right on the music. That was cute. Boom. It does sound like Sweet Victory. Holy fuck. I, I was trying to think. I was like, what, like... Power ballad or whatever the fuck sounds like this. It's totally sweet victory. Uh, please, there's like a ceiling there. What? This bouncy tornado thing is very strange. Come on. That is weird. They can't, like, bounce on the- Fuck you! I okay. Straight up, sometimes I'm, like, collecting DK barrels, and they don't give me a partner, and then I just die. What is with that? Does anybody know what's up with that? Like, what? what, what is that? Does anybody know what's happening? Like, here, I don't have a Diddy Kong. I'm gonna walk into a DK barrel. Okay, Diddy's there. I swear, sometimes it's just not doing that, though. Shit's fucking whack. And, like, I don't get hit, and then I fucking... Okay, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> I can't do anything about it. Besides just save state. Whenever I hear... Whenever I say the word save state the phrase. This part sounds like Sweet Victory. Uh... I think of Flood from Mario Sunshine saying it. Save state. It's because she said shine, sprite, um. Um? The fuck is this zone? The nonsense zone? Okay. What the fuck? I just went to, like, the Sweet Tooth Galaxy from Mario Galaxy. <laughs> We, we just briefly went into, like, Yoshi's story for a second there. Pfft. Cool hitbox. That's just the tutorial that you can kill those things, but we figured that out earlier. And found a secret! You, you really can't jump on those. I thought I just, like, janked it earlier. No, it's impossible to do. They just instantly kill you from any angle. Okay. Normally you can bounce off those. It's just I might divide this into two streams because this game is slightly soul-crushing to play. You know? I think what we're gonna do is just occasionally use save states at our leisure, and then... If I ever want to refill on lives, just allow a game over to go through after I actually beat a level. You know? I... Oh, they just come in so fast. That one I wasn't trying to jump on. It just sort of happened. It just sort of appeared beneath me. That's why I feel the need to go, like, slower. Hold on. What would happen if I just stood on this? 
Oh, he plugs it up. Stump. He just like sticks his little Diddy Kong ass in there. Plugs up the vase. What a guy. Ah, uh, that sucks. I tried to jump. What do you mean? Oh, I can just walk right through those, can I? Okay. Fuck! <laughs> uh, oh, I, I, I need to slow down there. Badly. Okay, whatever. I, did we get the midway checkpoint here? Fuck it, who cares? Who cares? That title screen is so fucking weird looking. Oh, no. Okay, uh... Guess we're loading a save state, fuck. It sent me back to the- But that's strange. Right? Because it didn't send me back to the beginning of the world last time. It's not too much ground we have to make back up, but what the fuck? Why'd it do that? There was another, like, earlier I got a game over and it didn't send me back to the beginning of the world that I was in. But here it did. <laughs> Just sucks him up. Okay. Can I just go this way? <laughs> oh shit! Giant clam. Very cool. What what is this level? Oh, optional water level, eh? Hmm. <laughs> Not the worst thing. DK. Okay, Sheen. This is the third time you've shown. DK written out in bananas to the class. <laughs> There's like occasional warbles on the music here, but it's on the- I don't know why, but on the map screen it's just fucked. Like, I don't really mind it in the gameplay at all. In fact, it even adds to it slightly, I think, in a way. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. I am sounding like a fucking dog right now. I just have a, a sniffles. Mm. Oh. I'm glad they make those gaps wide enough for you to squeeze through. <laughs> All that kind of went with the music, like the bananas and then the death. It was in a way beautiful. Losing at Donkey Kong Land. It, the these levels in particular kind of look like ass, but <laughs> whatever. It's like, what is this above me? It's like a bunch of bulbs. I keep seeing it as like one of those signs where you like write something out in a bunch of little red bulbs, you know? But it's just constantly above us. Is that eggs? Like, what is above? Oh. Yeah, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. We gotta play. Gotta win the game. <laughs> I, I don't really have much to say anymore about this. <laughs> it's like, am I, I, mean, I could really go play the rest of this game. I think I should. I think I should. There's probably gonna be fun some funny stuff. Some weird shit, right? <clears throat> We've already been blessed with lots of weird shit. Okay. <clears throat> Phew, that's sketchy. Oh, the bomb. Nice. Oh, I wanted that last banana! No, no, no! Okay. I wanted that last banana. 
Bayfruit, play Sonic 4 Episode 2. I'm going to do that. That's the worst part. That's the worst part of all this, is I'm going to do that. I'm going to play it. I'm probably going to play it on keyboard. I think I learned my lesson. I'm going to be a psychopath and play Sonic on keyboard. BOMB! Oh, great. I have unlocked, with that optional water level, another optional water level. It's up here. Fuck. Oh, new enemy. What does it do? Oh! Is that a new enemy? Yeah, that's a new enemy. I don't remember that fucking thing. Weird, like, Nautilus that chases you? Actually, what the fuck? Stop. <laughs> Get away from me. That's my purse, I don't know you. Pocket sand, etc. Other King of the Hill references, fuck. Okay. Oh, Mark S. Ooh. There's, like, new graphics on the clam enemies. I think they're, they're functioning pretty similarly. Are they even shooting out little things? No, they're just opening and closing. Curious. Ho! Oh, okay. Analog horror game. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck. Okay, we're gonna save here. Okay, well, uh, let's be a little more careful. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh fuck. It's like a chase, it's almost like a scripted chase segment. It's like that part in 2, where you're getting chased by the bee. Sorry, you can probably hear the loud motor outside through my microphone. <laughs> I was so scared by the Nautilus, I think it's not chasing me anymore. Actually, is it? Fuck. It might be. If it is, uh, I'm gonna get fucked. Nope. Oh! Oh god! Oh. Where do I go? Where do I go? <laughs> or I guess there's, like, the octopus. This is, like, the equivalent of the octopus that chases you in, uh, DKC1 that has the little spinning... There's a lot of them. Little spinning tentacles. Which I'm told is the name of SpongeBob's grumpy neighbor. <laughs> Please clap. Fuck. Oh, you can just swim right over that without a care in the world. Okay. I don't know why I'm, like, on crack today. Sometimes I, I just am on crack. It's fine. Crack is for everyone. A dab a do ya. No, I do not actually endorse crack. Oh god. Oh god! It's still chasing me. This has got to be the final, like, gauntlet here. Nope, there's a second checkpoint, though. Okay. Germa moment. Having to clarify, I am stealing Germa jokes left and right. He's been streaming for like fucking 50 years. Uh, it's impossible to not steal bits from him. Look at the creative way they just used that clam enemy. Look at the creative way they just fucked me in the ass. Having to, like, do a disclaimer that you're not actually on crack. <laughs> I bet there's some streamers who do crack. <laughs> I don't know. It's not Germa. Not me. Okay, we're just gonna slowly float. Oh. Okay, this is just a pit. Long level. Uh... 
They keep sort of bumping into like weird invisible walls that are in places I feel like they shouldn't be. But then I like press and then they're not there. It's very strange. There's that level end hole. I bet you that's a fucking thing. I bet you they fucked around with having normal endings and then they like couldn't get it to work or something. I mean, it seemed like when we were going into the secrets, like they couldn't get the sprite layering properly done. So I don't know. Okay. I'm gonna save. <laughs> right. Oh, this is a different level, actually. <laughs> Are you gonna do edibles on stream like Germa did? I had no idea that Germa did edibles on stream. <laughs> is that true? Okay, hold on. I clearly need to figure these out. I didn't just load the save state. No, it didn't happen. So I need to like move a little slowly. Interesting. These are a weird game mechanic. I kind of like them though. <laughs> they look so out of place. That's funny to me. I'll get fucked, nerd. Something's off about the bees, too. Have they all looked this fucked up? Where's their, like, head? Like, their eyes are, like, tiny? If that's what their eyes are, I don't even know. I loved the Germa bit where my favorite, like, some of Germa's bits, I'm like, okay, that's just weird. Like, what the fuck is this? Some of the ones that were actually, like, really funny was eating a shoe and then eating a glove. It's like he went the extra fucking mile and ate a goddamn glove. Wow. He got like a chocolate glove and a, a chocolate shoe and a cake glove. He just decided he was gonna do that. Fuck. I, I kind of think I'm gonna split this game up into two streams. I, I, my plan was to blitz through all of it, but it's a little longer than I thought it was gonna be. And I probably should have expected uh, to die a lot playing it wow playing a DKC game for the first time essentially or playing you know this is basically a new entry in the series for me still have yet to get around to playing returns and tropical freeze uh, but I will at some point I've played uh, returns not tropical freeze and it's very good I like it a lot I just have not got around to it Sweet victory part. <laughs> okay. That is very stressful. Here we go. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> Weird mechanic. There wasn't really anything specifically like this in the original games. Oh, fuck. I see now my error. Okay, whatever. There's cheeky little, like, level design puzzles, too. Which I like. They kept that shit in. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, shit! Smart boy. Oh, god. Okay, the ruined city makes another appearance. Great. You know what? Save. It's on a whim. O G. Just like me. I'm what they call original gangster. Whoa, wait, what just happened? Oh. <sighs> okay. There's another like level to do, though. Should I do that before I do this? This seems like boss. <laughs> it's like, okay, look at the level beneath me that's like the only one that's not flashing. That's also on this screen. But you can't actually access that version of it, because this is like a different map screen. So I wonder, man, like with, with like hacks or something, if you could somehow stand on that one. Where would it take you? Because I remember there was that shit in DKC1 where if you, like, hit enter level on, like, a precise part of, like, whenever the path would turn 
like 90 degrees or whatever. It only happened a couple times in the first world, but it's very convenient for speedrunning. It's like you could do a weird wrong warp, you know? I, I wonder if... I, I wonder what's up with that. I don't know. You can tell. Look at the two... Uh, oh, it's the monkey sound. <laughs> the menu seems less fucked now. But look at the tunnel that I just went through. Both instances of it are the exact same sprite. There's clearly been some copy-pasting. Done. Which I know that's not a huge observation, it's just the original map screens were, uh, were all quite unique. 69? Do I have 69 bananas right now? No, it was 89. <laughs> 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 we one banana. Thank you. And we are gonna save state through this level, because this level was kind of a pain in the ass. If memory serves. Like normally in the original, they would like show what monkey threw that barrel. Not here. We we don't have that tech. Okay, back to like Cloud Candy Land. I guess those things are not actually solid objects. Ooh, this is very sketchy. It's such a tiny platform. Oh lord. Oh god. Well, glad I jumped. There's that classic. They lead you with the bananas. Okay. That, like, texture is fucked up. The heart's there. Do you see that? Oh, shit! K.O. Nice. Well, that was fucking weird. Clownland. Goofy zone. I-I guess... Finally, my home planet. I suck at that part. It's just you have a decision to make, and and if you don't decide fast, you're just gonna get fucked. Okay, and here's the part that kept killing me over and over again. Not this part. This part right here. No, not this part right here. It's the part where you, like, pick up the explodey vase and then, like, run into the thing that just spat- here we go. Yeet that. There you go. And it does not respawn, thankfully. Whoa. <laughs> I like when they do that. They did that with, like, the oil drums in the original. Where the only thing to jump on is an obstacle that can, like, harm you. Is that, like, a clover? Oh. I got another one of those, but I don't think there's anything left to, like, break. Okay, I'm so glad I save-scummed through that level. <laughs> That would have taken so much longer. Otherwise. Pay no attention to the fact that the amount of time on my save file is, like, distinctly different from the amount of time of this stream. That's... It don't matter. None of this matters. But now it's marked as different. This, like, thinking about that level and, like, the different map screens makes me think of, uh, like, Dark Souls 3. That one part where there's, like, a, a bridge that's broken and you can see items across the way. And it's, like, if you... If you use hacks to, like, walk across the gap, the items are, like, misplaced. They're, like, swapped around because, uh, that's, like, the version, that's, like, the LOD version of it. The low level of detail, like, distance version. But if you actually walk all the way around, the items are in the right place. But if you cross it from that other side of the... It's so weird. Hard to describe. Yeah, that happens quite a few times, but it's a well-known example. Probably the whole series has that. Okay, boss. It's a clam. How do I hit this? What is this? Oh, maybe I, like, get him to hit it? Nice! <laughs> uh, okay, what's, like, the twist, though? The Watushi. The twist. Wow, this is fucking stupid. What is it about Game Boy games and just having god-awful bosses? It's like games in, like, the Gold Source engine, where it's just not built for it. Like, it's not something they can do well. Is the 
bumper thing gonna like move around? No. Jesus, is this all that there is to this? Oh god, no! Oh wow! Cool projectile, bro. Just went right through my donkey legs. Get fucked. <laughs> the bosses are so weird and pathetic. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it there f for today, folks. I know that's a slightly short stream. Uh, but I have got 12 hours of Cuphead DLC footage to edit. And I'm maybe trying to get that video out like, in two days. I, I, that might be a, I, you know, that's probably a complete fool's errand, but I at least need to, like, work on it. Uh, so, I'm sorry, listen to that monkey sound, but we'll, we'll finish this next time. Nice, comfortable, it's either it was, either it was gonna be one kind of, like, uncomfortably long four-hour stream, or I was just gonna cut it in half and do two, like, 145. The math doesn't add up there, you know what I mean. Uh, so, nothing else today, I don't think. Uh, I gotta work on shit. But thank you so much for watching, folks. This is a strangely fun game with occasional huge annoyances that I'm glad that... I'm glad we can use our, our little tips and tricks, our, our emulation goblinry to, to get around it. Uh, so thanks for watching, everybody. I guess, is Lark on? I think he might be still streaming. Should we raid him? I think he's still streaming, yeah. Let's go raid Lark. He's making some weird art shit. Slash raid. At. Underscore. Lark. Alright. I don't know why it has to, like, count down from ten to actually do a raid. I guess it's just people, like, getting ready. Alright. Go say some words. See you guys.